Hello, welcome to the Yonkers Riverfront Art Gallery and the Yonkers Riverfront Library in downtown Yonkers. My name is Hafa Bent Cotty and I'm the curator here. I'd like to show you our current show, Love is the Only Norm, which was designed specifically for LGBTQ artists. This show challenges viewers to consider identity beyond binaries by celebrating the depth and breadth of gender expression. Come with me as I show you a few pieces. This piece is titled Next, and it's by emerging local artist Darius Martinez. This piece brings me a lot of joy. In it, Darius is using collage on a found object to explore his identity, his indigenous identity. And I love the ways in which he has invited the viewer in. You can open the door, almost like a secret compartment, and you will see lots of flora and fauna. And most of the images that you see in this piece are flowers and things of flight, like birds and butterflies, lots of blossoms. And then there's a secret compartment here where Darius almost assumes a fetal position as if he's at the beginning of his life cycle. But as you circle around the piece, you begin to see that Darius is telling a story here. You see the flowers, different references to blossoms and the giving way and the birth. And you see Darius in the back who has blossomed, who has taken off and found himself in joy and has become one with the flora and the fauna. And you continue to see birds and almost scientific descriptions of the plants and the flowers. And as you circle back to the front, you've experienced the whole life cycle of this piece. I look at it every day that I come into the gallery. This piece is by Ricardo Osmondo Francis, and it's titled Anthony in a Red Choir Robe in Whose Identity? It's acrylic, mixed media, and it's collage on canvas. There's so many layers to Ricardo's work and so many ways that viewers can access this work. First of all, I have to mention that Ricardo always uses a bit of glitter or gold in his pieces, which give a luminance to his figures and create a bit of mystery as you look at it. There are many, many layers to the collage. Ricardo applies a strong layer of collage when he begins, paints over it, and then continues to collage images that suggest iconography from the 50s and the 60s, and sometimes, sometimes contemporary iconography. But all of his pieces deal with black male identity and sometimes toxic identity, but also referencing his childhood growing up in a religious community, being a black male who also has a Hispanic identity. All of these things come into play in Ricardo's work. 